if you've recently started a podcast or a video podcast, a live stream perhaps, how exactly are you going to get the word out? And what means by which do you want to get the word out? Hi, I'm Mark Bullock. I'm the co-founder of Video Socials, as well as our VIP services for video, video interview podcast services for clients. So there's a couple of things I want you to, to, to think about. When you're creating a, whether it be a video interview podcast, a live stream, whatever the case may be, this is a form of long form content. Long form content is not necessarily the best thing to throw out there on social media and or in newsletters or email blasts, et cetera, because it's not designed to grab their attention from the, from the, from the get-go and draw them into a conversation. It's designed to give some meat to and more in-depth information and more conversational information to an audience, usually an established audience. That being the case, how do you get shorter, smaller pieces of content out there that are designed to attract them, that are compel them to want to know more and to be willing to invest the time to consume that 20, 30, 40 minute piece of content called a podcast? Well, a great way to do that is with video socials. So videosocials.net and click on the guest tab. We'd love to have you as a guest, but what you're gonna find is we get together as a group of professionals, all getting better on camera, all practicing and all getting our shorter videos, one to three minutes done, fun and done on a, on a weekly basis. So. What all would you use these videos for other than, quote, an introduction, say, for example, to your podcast? Well, each person that you interview, each person, each time that you create a podcast or a live stream, it's going to have a different topic. It's going to have a, it's going to have a different um, area that you're going to be, uh, that may be attractive to a potential audience. So it's a great idea to, after you create the, after you create the podcast, to create a short video that, and again, I say short because things like Instagram and, and others ha have very limited amount of, of upload space for, for videos. So, but using video, if you're doing a video podcast is, is the best way to get the information out there, but you can give in a minute or two really compelling information as to why they might wanna spend 30 minutes, 40 minutes to absorb and read that podcast. And then as the bonus, you get to do that in a group setting, as I am now in a video socials meeting with other people that are doing the same that you're doing and get their feedback as to how your message lands. And as well as you get the more you practice, the more comfortable that you're going to get on camera. So I hope you'll take us up on coming as a guest. Again, videosocials.net. There'll be a link below. And just click on the guest tab and, and uh, we'd love to meet you. Again, this is Mark Bullock, the co-founder of videosocials.net and of our phone book, excuse me, of our video socials VIP services. Have a great day.